Hey, it's George with Watchman German Shepherd. It's going to talk a minute or two here before the video about a condition that comes about through grain-free food. And I mentioned in the video, I give my dogs eggs, I give them uh, mozzarella cheese and a high-quality grain food, uh, real chicken, real oats. And so when you come to some of these designer or boutique foods that are grain-free, uh, high in legumes, well, they lack a certain ingredient that is found in meats and poultry and fish. And so that particular ingredient is taurine. And so this condition that comes about from the grain-free food is taurine, a taurine deficient cardiomyelopathy. And so after some years of the dogs having uh, the grain-free food, they find that it becomes a problem. And so uh, I recommend to you uh, not using grain-free food. I will leave the link for the one article that, that I'm pretty much uh, referencing here, but there are more than one. And I'll also leave a link for the grain food that I use with my dogs in my kennel. It's from Nutrisource, N-U-T-R-I. There is a N-U-T-R-A source, but this is Nutra source with an I. And they have grain-free, but they also have grain food, uh, which I recommend. So I'll leave a link for that um, at the bottom in the description. And so, you know, there's so much out there, especially with food for people and for dogs. And, you know, uh, it's not that there's never a problem when you give your dogs, you know, these types of foods that have whether chicken or beef or cheese, I'm sorry, chicken or beef or cheese, uh, not that there's never a problem with those, uh, because sometimes there are, sometimes dogs can't digest, uh, break down, the enzymes don't break down a uh, particular type of protein, and so uh, it's not that it's um, a rule without exception, but it's a good rule. You got to start somewhere. And to me, again, these boutique foods that they've had out for the last years, uh, well, sometimes things aren't all that. And for many years, the eggs and, and cheese and fish or whatever that dogs would naturally eat, uh, they've been surviving fine. So have human beings. And so again, that doesn't mean there's never a problem. But if your solution uh, brings about another problem, well, you don't have a solution. And so I just pass it on to you. The Lord bless you, and uh, we'll see you after the video. Take care. Hey, I just gave the dogs a little mozzarella cheese. I give them mozzarella cheese, I give them eggs, of course, kibble. And happy to be out here today enjoying a little cooler weather right here it's Prada what are you doing Prada then Eva hello Eva Eva's Prada's daughter with cross over there and that's Kelly right there and so Got half the pack out here, the other, well, it's not, it's actually more than half. Um, and four of the dogs here, and then two inside. And then some puppies. But it's a beautiful morning. This morning was in the 30s, actually. The little brook is running nice. Got some rain for a few days there. I love this little brook.
Oh, here's a friend. Here's a friend. Hello, Ronnie. Come on. Ronnie uh, has got her four puppies right now. And she doesn't want to go out in the big pen. She wants to stay close, right? Come on, Rhonda. Let's see your puppies. Come on. Good girl. Good girl. Come on, Dad. Yeah, Rhonda took the puppies out of the whelping box, so they're just free to go here. I got the heat lamp for them, but they don't want it. They go away from it. And so at two weeks, the puppies uh, can generate and maintain their own body heat. So um, they don't want too much otherwise. The building does stay kind of warm, even though I don't have the heat on. But even that heat lamp in this room, which is all insulated heavily, um, that heat lamp itself will make this room warmer in this temperature. If it's uh, teens and all, well, that's another story. Look at this guy. Yeah, all the puppies are getting along. Hello puppies. Hello puppies. It'll be three weeks by the way on Saturday. Today is Tuesday, so the two and a half weeks. And really coming along good. You see them walking. A little shaky, but they're walking. And that's what they do when they're looking for food. You got any food for them, Rhonda? Move this chair out of here so they have a little more room, a little less obstacle. Come on, Ronnie, come see your puppies. Come, come. Hop up. Good girl. See your puppies. Go ahead. Rhonda. Yeah, she'll come in. Anyway. That's a little going on here in the morning. Tuesday, December, what? Tuesday, December 18th, I think. 2022. So, okay, cut it off there. A little short update. The Lord bless you as you trust him, most important. If you have not subscribed, please do like, share, comment, question. Check out the uh, Bible verse at the end of the video. Uh, the Bible says that the word of the Lord is true and all of his righteous judgments endure forever. And you can take that to the bank, the bank of the eternal eternal bliss promised through Jesus Christ. So I'll leave you with that. Have a great day.